What was the rarest chemical or substance you guys have found on the asteroid sample? So one of the exciting things for me was finding uh, material that, that was floating around in the protoplanetary disk before um, Bennu's parent body accreted. So we do find some tiny grains of minerals like uh, hibonite and spinel, for example, which are very, very rare in Bennu. And, and we think these may have been among the oldest grains and they survived all of this water wow. reaction. Mm -hmm. Wow. So they can give us a glimpse back to what the protoplanetary disk was like at that time. So, so that's a that, that's sort of my favorite rare thing. Anything rare on the organic side? Well, actually, I was, I, I was, was going to say no. But now that I think about it, you know, we actually found uh, 33 amino acids in total detected in, in the Bennu samples. 14 were protein amino acids, but the other 19 were non-protein, not found in biology. Mm. And in fact, mm. we're finding some amino acids that don't even occur naturally on the Earth. They're, they truly are rare, some of these non-protein amino acids. So, wow. Have you seen so them in meteorites before? We have seen them in okay, meteorites, okay. but uh -huh. I just wanted to make that point. You know, we're seeing the building blocks of life, but we're also seeing these other similar compounds that, for whatever reason, mm. weren't, weren't used by life. So that's a mm. whole another mystery in and of itself. Why did life choose those 20 uh, yeah. when there were hundreds of amino acids available?